clean up my purse with me. Sorry, that was really bad. But clean up my purse with me. I went to Kentucky again. Yes, I know. But it's really bad this time. Like, really, really bad. So, first, I'm gonna do that. And I'm <laughs> We're going to explain what everything is. The book. We'll get more into detail about that if you haven't watched the books. Sanitizing wipes from the airline. Glue and shampoo. Conditioner bottle. Ear pods. Googly eyes in a snack bag from the airline. Money. Coins. And these random accordion book thingies that. Have no use for a problem for some reason. Okay, so first we're going to put away the sanitizing wipes, which just go straight back into my bag because I take this bag it, like almost everywhere. Kind of, I take it to a lot of places. Base, I take it to a lot of places basically. So yes. Okay, <laughs> I don't know what that was, but whatever. Okay, so now. I'm going to put the moolah away and the coins. Now, I have a jar in my room, which I brought just for this. And we just stick the money in there. Now, usually coins go into a different pickle jar that's painted. My mom painted this for my 12th birthday, for your information. And, yes, yeah, so we're going to put these in there because I just want to. Okay, I'll put that away later. And then this bag is going to just... I think I'm going to put it back in because if I find coins, I can put them in here. So this is going back in the bag. I know a lot of stuff is going back in the bag, but that should be the last time something goes in the bag. So these like accordion book binding things will literally just pop onto my desk. Now the googly eyes and the glue, I'm gonna do something with you guys with my with the book. So we're gonna put these close by my desk. Same thing with the book. So then these AirPods are not actually mine. Mine are in my desk and I forgot them while we were flying. So these are gonna be my mom's, so I'll give those to her later. So now we need to move. We moved. Okay doc. So got book, the googly eyes, and the glue and the shampoo bottle. So, <coughs> long story short on the book, it is technically a journal, and, well, it's literally called Travel Notes, but I took it to the Rockies, and I wrote in it day by day about my day and my adventures, so, yeah, I guess that's the book. And then I accessorized it all with everything. So we're gonna be putting some Google eyes in a easy book. Not a super weird book, whatever. Hold on. I don't think you're gonna be able to see it. I don't know how to make you guys see it. I'm sure. Literally like that, I don't think I can hold. What can I use? What can I use to hold? This is literally my phone that I'm using, which I think I've told you guys that multiple times before. Can I take the lid of this? It's gonna fall. Can I get something? This is kind of funny. Um, you guys get to watch me struggle because my hedgehog. This is Prickles. He's my tape hedgehog. Can I? Okay, so, hi, I guess. Book. This is so weird. So basically, we're gonna go over what my pages look like. Hold on. Yes. Alright, day one. This is literally just the flight. So that's super boring. Day two, we surprised my step-grandmother 
uh, with posters and stuff from the airport. This is full day too. This was the best day ever. That's when I got. We went to a pizza place that had a jailhouse. That was an old jailhouse, which was awesome. It was in Brandenburg, Kentucky. Go to it. It's pretty good. Uh, and they ate, and you can literally eat in a jail cell, so that's pretty cool. Um, and I have my googly eyes. Hold on. Not that page. I have my googly eyes. Oh, and this is the last page, actually. Sorry. Last page, which was today. And then here's some stuff that I put in it. These are all comic strips. And if you guys know some of these names, like or comment if you can. Beetle Bailey. Um, Fort Knox. I don't know this one, but if you know what the name is, please tell me. No, a googly eye popped off. Oh, no. I gotta fix that. You guys get to see me fix a googly eye. Um, Dilbert, that's pretty funny. Also, I don't know this burrito one, but it's funny too. Jumpstart or Dustin. There's some more. First, well, no, put that googly eye. Specific. And then this is the pizza jailhouse card thing. We have, there's another one that, oh, here it is. Fort Knox, BC. Oh, and Hagar the Horrible. If you guys know any of those, comment down below. Which ones you know, or which one, which other ones are your favorite? Now, you take this and glue. Actually, I kind of want to get a paintbrush. I'm gonna go get a paintbrush. Hello, you see my face? I'm gonna go get a paintbrush. Okay, we're gonna put it in. I got my paintbrush. Back in the, okay. Get stick the papers in the glue bottle. We're gonna glue the little baby poo back on. So this is gonna be a little bit of a pain since I can't can get it open. I'm scared. Okay, got it open. Now you're just gonna stick the brush in the glue. This is one dollar glue from the Dollar Tree. It's like called Jot. But it's the cheapest glue I could find to where I'm pretty okay leaving that I had to leave the whole bottle at the, ho the hotel, not the hospital hotel. I don't know why I tried to say hospital. Okay, we put the glue on and we're just gonna glue it back on. Simple as so. And it's supposed to be quick drying, but I don't think it really is. Also that snipping is the little poof poof in the back, huckleberry. And maybe we'll do some glue draw, drawing with glue or something, that'd be cool. But right now, we're not. We are just going to wait for this to dry. Yeah, we're just gonna paint So We're just gonna do some painting, I guess. Paint on the tape, just like smooth it out. I don't have any glitter. I wish I had glitter. That'd be cool if I had glitter. And I know it sounds like I'm talking to myself, but when I try and do stuff like this, that's what it kinda sounds like. Like I'm talking to myself. I'm just trying to get the glue off. Now do I have anything that I can put on this to make it look pretty or cool or whatever? I don't think I do because I don't really want to put googly eyes on it. Oh, I need a little bit. Are you tried? Well, this glue is definitely gonna not not gonna dry. I'm gonna put this down on this is literally what I do I'm going to take a post-it note and I'm really going to dry it clean off this tape this glue I need And I know what some people are going to say, yeah, that's not what you're supposed to do. I don't care. 
Actually, I kind of want you guys to say it. It's kind of funny reading hate comments. And you can literally tell me I need the camera, whatever you want. I don't really care. If you can comment, I don't even know if you can. I want you guys to. But if you can't, make your way. Still not dry. I always do this and I'm gonna close it. Which I know it has tape. Oh my gosh, yes I know. That's the point. I'm going to smush it with the glue so it can get dry quicker. And if you can do it quick enough, you can pull the pages off. And it actually dries the glue a lot quicker. That one's pretty good now. Okay. But we're gonna just do it. Oh, just smash it, smash it, smash it, smash it. And it's gonna happen like this, where it's gonna stick. You can just pull it right off. And you just gotta get it to dry. And it will be fine. A okay. <laughs> I'm not used to this whatsoever. Um, I think it's good now. Do it one more time. Make sure it sticks on. Yeah. Good. Pretty good. I'm just gonna put like a post it note in it, in between it, like over it, just so it's there's not much of a chance to stick over. Moving on. No. There we go. I have googly eyes there. I'm still gonna add some googly eyes because I like googly eyes. So we're going to open. Open the magical bag of Google eyes. Close your eyes. My eyes are closed. And we're gonna mix this up and I'm gonna pull one and then I'll pull another. And wiggle my hand. Okay, we got a big one. I don't know if you can see this. Okay, next one. Oh, we got another big one. Uh, I guess, do I have two big ones? No, it's just it's a big one. one. Okay, we're gonna add it right here because there's a teeny little space. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna dip in the glue. Ooh, that's a hot tip. We're gonna take the back of googly eye and we're gonna just paint it on. I think you can see that. Do you think you can see that? If you can't, I'm sorry. I'm gonna put down a googly eye. Ready to go. And we're gonna take the next one. Paint on the glue. Very nicely. And we're going to push it down. I'm gonna just take a little bit of glue. and put some in between them so I can make sure that they stay. And this does dry clear. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna make eyebrows out of glue. Yeah, I'm totally gonna do that. You got eyebrows out of glue. That's gonna take forever to dry. Who cares? Get some sideburns on the googly eye. Sideburns, maybe like a little mustache. That's a weird mustache. Something just googly eye just fell. Hmm, where can I put you? I'm just gonna put a random googly eye on this. That would be funny. Just put a and I lost it. Where'd it go? Go anywhere. I don't know where it went. Oh, found it. Found the googly. I'm literally just gonna stick it like right up here in the corner. I'm just gonna stick it right up there in the corner. What the heck? 
Boom. Put Google Leaf there. We're gonna make like a one eyebrow or something. Eyelid, I guess you could say. And now we're going to literally paint. Take our post it that we used and just pull the paint up. Not paint, the glue. my glue brush now and I guess come back when it's I'll come back when it's done I can't do that <laughs> okay Oosh. and I will come back in the next clip or whatever it is when it's done okay it's oops sorry it's been like an hour later and all of the glue for the eyebrows have gone are gone now um same thing with this one so we're gonna check this really quick oh, stuck. okay and this should be fully dried okay the googly is good now but that sucks this one's pretty dry. This one's not, you literally can't, it's not dry. And it's super cold. Oh, it's, it started raining. Yeah. It started raining. Oh, I'm freezing. Do you want to see my Halloween costume? This is what me and my friend are going to be for Halloween. First, I want you to put down your answer in the comments if you can do that, or just think, because I highly doubt you're going to be able to figure this out unless I've actually told you this. So get ready to be confused, amazed, and just, eh. Okay, ready? It's a cow onesie, and it's a peanut butter. <laughs> Me and my best friend always do um, duo casters together. So this year, we're going to be peanut butter and jelly cows. I am peanut butter because I love peanut butter, and she's not a big of a fan of it. And she's jelly because she loves jelly, and I hate it. And... We were literally just going to be peanut butter and jelly, but we wanted to get a cow costume also because we did we got to party see and we didn't know what to get. So we also wanted to get the cow costume, we got that too. And now the peanut butter jelly cows. How do I look? Amazed? Yeah. <laughs> okay, back to what this video is actually. Also it was like an hour of waiting for that glue to dry. Booty boo boo. I don't know what I put, but okay. But, okay, I put the eyes on this one. I don't know if you can see it. I don't think you can still see it. I put the eyebrows and the mouth on that one. It you can't really see the eyebrows like in life and in video also. And then while I was waiting, I labeled my glue bottle. I need to get some Elmer's glue or something once I use that up. I still need to put the eyebrow on this little, this little guy. Can you dry? Can't really see it. There we go. There, is my pit still nice and brick. Okay. Um. I think that's it. I'm pretty positive that's it. I don't know if there's anything else that I do need to do in here. Huh. Okay, well, I got to close that. Put that there. Um, is there anything else I can do? 
And no, if anyone says to put googly ads and stuff in here, I'm not doing that. This is for that. This is like a label thing, like how my triples. Should I actually need to do something? Okay, labeled my trip. It was 10 out of 10. Best trip ever. Oh, I told you guys that I was going to. Oh my god. Look. Also, when I meant like that, like up like that, and not like when you close it, it's like that, like literally, like there's so much stuff where it's gonna be filled up like that. Oh, also, I made a post it damn pocket. If you have any post-it stamp recommendations, um, comment them down below and I'll see if I can find them. Because I like my postage stamps. And I'm going to make a post-it gallery. Also, the postage stamps are for sending me postcards and sending my grandpa postcards. And possibly my best friend. Not really ever though, but mostly me. Um, I think that is it. Actually, no. We are going to do something with the glue bottle. We're going to take our paintbrush. This is not my glue paintbrush. Our glue bottle. And I'm going to take some glue and put it on the sides to make sure they stick good. So we're going to open up our glue bottle tab. And we're going to dip the paintbrush in a little teensy bit of glue. And we're going to Rub it on the sides. Hi, Miss Cora. Keep on rubbing it on the sides. Then we're gonna rub down. Okay. And now we're gonna. the cap now. Rub on the sides. Bloop, bloop. We gotta make sure it gets on there. Rub it down. Rub it over. Rub it down. We're also gonna take the back and we're gonna push it in like so and then we're gonna brush it down. And then brush the glue over. And then we'll get the bottom once the sides dry. Ooh, that's a lot of glue. That's alright. Going to put on a slab of glue. Smooth it out. What do you see, Miss Huckleberry? What do you see? Okay, you left. This is gonna fall over if I smooth the sides out.
Also, I used the paper of a post-it note. That was weird. I'm just so quiet. And then I just all of a sudden start talking. ASMR. You can't really hear anything at all, so. You can't really hear anything when I do that, so. I guess I can't really do ASMR. Also, I already put my purse away, and if you want to know where I put my purse, um, go watch another video of cleaning out my purse. Also, I still don't know when, um, this video was. Also, sometimes I do use a different app, so I can do multiple clips, and that is literally an app on iPhones that are just, like, downloaded by themselves, and they're called, and it's called Clips. And it's a really good, it's a pretty good app. I won't say the best, but it's pretty good. So I'm just gonna look through the stickers while I wait. Ah, oh no, oh no, I'm not sticker over there. Okay. Also, give me some recommendations on when my next trip should be, no, not when, where my next trip should be. Should be. I think I'm going to Kentucky again this year. Um, I think for like Thanksgiving or something. But we're trying to pick, but we're trying to figure out somewhere to go for Christmas. So, yeah. <laughs> and then I think for Christmas we want to try and go to Arkansas, cause there's this like diamond mining place. It's like real diamonds and you dig in the ground and I really want to go there. So yeah, I'll come back when it's dry, when this little thingy is dry and then close it. There we go. Ah. When that thing is dry and then we'll paint the bottom and I think that might be it. Honestly, I don't even know if my book will be able to fit in there. <laughs> also, um, I have a book too for when it's, this one is filled. Um, hold on, I'll come back when I find it. Bloop. Oh my gosh, I'm an idiot. I literally was doing all a bunch of stuff. I wasn't recording. I'm an idiot. I didn't do a whole lot, I don't think. I was just talking and we designed the glue bottle and we were just painting it, painting that. And I, oh my god, I'm so mad. And now I'm, like I said, my goal is to make it this thick. Um, my postage stamp gallery, I don't really remember what I showed you. Um, I was just going through, making sure everything was good. Also, where do you think I should go next? That was like one of the things. I'm going to Kentucky Thanksgiving, I think. Thanksgiving or Christmas is one of those. And then, we want to try and go to Arkansas to go see this diamond mining place that is open to the public and you can go and take diamonds from the dirt and whatever you find you can keep also i do have a backup for book one um, book one i have a book two here it is now i know it's not as thick but still i really liked this one as it says let's go on the adventure and i'll put like book two like right there and put book two on the spine, make like a pen. Oh no, will my pen fit? Will it fit? It just barely fits. And then like I'll put the back thing that I have. And my goal will probably be to fill it up to like this high probably. I labeled this travel book too, but I literally call it the book. That's what it's going to be called, so. 
Yeah, it has nothing in it right now, like literally nothing. So that will be really exciting when we get something. What did I put on this first page? Hold on. I need to see. Did I just skip it? Oh. It starts with two pages, that's why. Well, with the first page, because it's like this and also has a little bit of a so. Um, for the first page, I'm not gonna do it now. Hi, Miss Baby, you can you video me, 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 and it will not get thrown away. It definitely won't. It won't come with me anymore, though, on when in my travels. But it will still be remembered and read in all kinds of mumbo jumbo. And put that back. Come on, get back in there. Okay. Okay. Um. I think that's it. Oh. I already painted the bottom too. I'm dropping everything. Okay, that's pretty much it. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's probably one of my longest videos ever, which is actually really cool. Excuse me. Um, but yeah, also, what other decorations should I put in my book? I'm doing ribbon, googly eyes, obviously. Um, what else should I put? I'm not doing beads unless they're, like, pretty flat. Um, because I don't want it to get, like, super, super bad. Super, super thick. I don't really want to use beads overall, though. Um, I'm open to, like, wooden stuff, I guess. Like, what kind of, like, decoration or, like, deco or whatever should I put in the book to make it fatter but also just to make it look better like just make it look cool and it's only gonna go in the pages unless like i really like it like really 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 like it and we'll go on the outside but it probably won't um but what should i put on the pages like when i finish writing should, like around the borders on like the spine i'm not putting beads on the spine or like googly eyes or anything nothing like close to the spine unless it's a ribbon um i'm open like I said, to wooden stuff, paper stuff, obviously, like, flat things, a little bit of bulgy stuff, like the googly eyes, like, maybe accordion stuff, that would be pretty cool. I actually have, hold on, I have this, it's an accordion fold, and it folds out, it's all one page, it folds out like that. That would be kind of cool to add to the, to the book. That would be cool. But what should I put in it is the question. If you have ideas for that and you can comment, please do. That would be deeply appreciated. Um, or go to my TikTok and like comment in any TikTok video. My username is AspireGymnast underscore 11. So yeah, if you can comment in YouTube, you can definitely go comment in... Sorry, it's raining. In my videos, I keep the comments open for most of them. And you can, you don't really have to follow me, I honestly don't care. Oh, it's a private account. So follow me to see my content, and then when you're done, just unfollow me, honestly. Actually, I'll just keep it publicly open for like three days or something. And then I'll go back to private, just so you guys can get that time. But please ideas i'm really open to almost anything just nothing like super bulgy so thank you guys so much for watching i really appreciate it if you subscribe hit that notification bell and like or any of those or comment you can literally just comment for all i care i'll like your video and if you have a youtube channel i'll check it out like some videos and stuff um but thank you guys so much for watching um it's deeply appreciated and if you do all those three things and comment You'll be in the hashtag notification squad and you'll be part of my family. 
that's probably not very big, but that's okay. Um, thank you guys so much. I love you. See you later.